Hey guys, welcome back. A new incremental OTA update is rolling out for OnePlus 6 and 60 users. And as you guys are aware, OnePlus have stopped the beta program for OnePlus 6 and 60. Now we'll be only getting updates based on stable channel. So right now you can see my device is running Oxygen OS 10.3.2 and we have a new update rolling out which is Oxygen OS 10.3.3. It's a stage rollout so might take some time to get it on your device but download links are available in the description below if you want to manually update. So what you need to do is download the file from the description below, place it inside the internal storage of your device. Avoid placing it inside any of the folders, keep it in the root directory. So here you can see I have the file and the file size is 1.96 GB close to 2 GB. Once you have downloaded and placed the file inside internal storage then go to settings, system, system update, tap the gear icon towards the right top corner, select local upgrade and choose the file and tap on install now. And for those who are still running beta channel, I'll mention a video guide in the description below which will help you to downgrade to stable channel. Once the installation process is completed, you can reboot your device. Device have been successfully booted up and we have installed the stable version of Oxygen OS which is 10.3.3. Let me show you the software information by going to settings, about section and here you can see Oxygen OS version is now 10.3.3. Under Android version, Android version is 10, security patch is 1st April 2020 and the build date is 14th April. After this update, launcher version is 4.3.8 but we have a new launcher version. Link of that will be given in the description below. You can download it manually on your device. I have made a dedicated video on that also. Make sure to check that out. Camera version has also been updated which is now 3.8.114. No new features added under camera. Now talking about the change logs of this latest version of Oxygen OS which is 10.3.3. With this update, changes are done under system, network updates and cloud storage. So first one under system it says fix the issue with a black screen randomly appearing while playing games. So normally I don't do gaming on my OnePlus 6 series. How many of you have been facing this issue? Do let me know in the comment section below. And also let me know whether this has been fixed or not. Then later they have updated the GMS package which means Google Mobile Services and they have updated that to Feb 2020. Later they have updated the security patch to 1st April 2020 which I have already shown you. So now we have the latest security patch of April that can be seen under Android version. So here you can see security patch level is now 1st April 2020. Later under system they have improved system stability and fixed general bugs. Next change log is related to network which says integrated Volti and Vo Wi-Fi support for Denmark. And the next one integrated Vo Wi-Fi support for Reliant Geo for Indian region. So now Geo users can enjoy Wi-Fi calling on this latest build. If you don't get Vo Wi-Fi symbol in the status bar then go to settings, SIM and network, select your SIM and under that you can find the option of Volti and Wi-Fi calling. Calling preference can be set to call over Wi-Fi whenever there is a Wi-Fi network available. If not you can also set preference to call over mobile network. And the last change log is related to cloud services in which they have updated the cloud service to version 2.0. So let's go and check that what changes they have done. Going to settings under cloud services. So this is the updated version of cloud services. Let me show you the screenshot of previous cloud service update. So this was the previous update on 10.3.2 in that notes was missing under cloud data sync. But now along with photos they have also added the notes section. So whatever notes you keep it on your device that will be directly sync to your cloud storage. So guys these are the changes done with latest Oxygen OS 10.3.3 for OnePlus 6 and 60. Now let's take a look at the benchmark results. With Geekbench application single core have scored 498 and multi-core have scored 2202. With Antutu benchmark application, device have scored 3,37,976. So guys, this was all about the latest update for OnePlus 6 and 60. If you still have any kind of questions, let me know in the comment section below. This is your friend Ashok signing out. See you guys in the next video.